One of the tricky things about filming outdoors when it's a bright day and there's clouds in the sky or you're going to be walking around somewhere and you're going in between trees and then coming out is that your exposure changes and if you're shooting in manual because you want to use ND filters and shoot with the 180 degree shutter rule then it's a little bit tricky to control the exposure so what I want to do is show you one way that you can kind of manage that so that your exposure doesn't shift too much. I'm currently filming with the Freewell wide angle lens and the ND32 filter and I'll put a link in the description to that pack because it's great because you can film with a wide angle lens or an anamorphic lens and still use ND filters at the same time so there's a link in the description to that. So I'm using that because I want to shoot in manual and the one way to get around the changes in exposure, so it is a very bright day today, but then I'm also walking between or walking underneath trees and whatnot. So the only way to really get around that is to set your ISO to something other than 100. So in setting your ISO to something like 3200 or 1600, then you're going to be able to essentially manage your exposure a little bit better so that the footage isn't necessarily being completely blown out or being too dark. So that's the, the best way of actually getting around that. And that's literally all I wanted to tell you. It's a little trick there. So do try that out. And if it works, come back and let me know. But yeah, I hope it was useful. If so, give the video a like and check out some of the other Pocket 2 videos if you haven't already. And also check out the LUTs for Decine Like as they will help you to color correct the footage really easily. But thanks for watching. Catch you next time.